Yo guys, what is going on? Bobby here and I am so happy to be back and making videos again. So I'm sorry I didn't have anything pre-recorded as I thought I'd have a lot more time to make videos. I was going to do it the morning of when I left except the flight and just everything happened so so quickly like just there was just really really poor planning basically and I couldn't have anything out for you guys. I did make one video but it was just such bad quality i really didn't like what i made in that video so i just decided not to release it but anyways i'm super 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 excited to be playing um just you know brawl stars again i literally haven't played in like three days just to be making videos connecting with you guys etc so basically what we're going to be doing today is pit is playing some power plays so you guys know it's the new mode that came out so currently there's a bunch of people with 99 score that is the highest score you can get um, you get a bonus, so you can get a maximum of 33 points per game. You guys can see this one guy is 120. Everyone was a little bit confused about that. He made a Reddit post. He said he lost two games, 1-1, one, one, was just spamming the ready button after his three games, and he somehow played a fourth game. So he has negative one out of three games played. Hopefully tomorrow that affects him, and he just won't be able to play three games. Hopefully he'll just get two, but... You know, don't, I wouldn't target him. He was super honest about it. He was really genuine. He was really cool. So, you know, shout outs to him for, uh, for, you know, just being honest, telling everyone what happened, his point of view, uh, because people were going to make it, would, you know, make assumptions, always hacking, always cheating, blah, blah, blah. So really good on him. But anyways, what we're going to be doing is doing one warm up game. This is going to be our power play squad throughout the seasons. As of now, myself, OG and second best. We're going to be going super try hard in the game. So what we're going to be doing is going one warm up game in Royal Flush Gem Grab since Gem Grab is going to be the mode. And, you know, after that, we're going to go into our three power play games. So enough talking. Let's head right into it. What brawler, what brawler am I supposed to play? Rosa. I'm a really good Rosa. SSG team captain. <laughs> Okay, so here we go into our first game. This is gonna just this is just gonna be a warm up. This is gonna be the comp we're going into minecart minecart with. So Rosa, Piper, and Tick. We're really hoping to get a maximum score, and we haven't played in a while, which is why we decided, you know, let's just get this first game out of the way. Let's get a little bit of a warm up. But anyways, I'm thinking we should be fine either way. So we're just gonna be chilling over here. I'm definitely the best Rosa on the squad, so I'm gonna be playing Rosa. Second best and OG are both fantastic pipers. But OG is going to go Piper today. You guys can see a really good three tap over there. This warm up is, you know, ladder isn't really the greatest for warming up, but we definitely need to do something to warm up. So I guess this is, this is just the best way. OG saves us with that snipe over there. Gonna move towards this Rosa, get a few shots in, then back off. Second best is gonna be able to get that kill. And we're currently up five nothing. So to get the extra points in gem grab, what we have to do is win the game before 15 gems spawn. So to do exactly what we're doing right now, and just absolutely run through teams and you know just don't hold back just continue trying don't bm a really good team of alec uh jack and crying man didn't even get max points because they bm the one game they lost countdown and then they didn't get fully max points the 99 instead they got 96 and we definitely do not want that happening to us today even though it doesn't really matter if you get max points in the 3v3s because i'm pretty sure most of the top end teams are going to get max points anyways the important thing is going to be when there's showdown or lone star or takedown it's still really important that you try to maximize so anyways we're going to hop into the real games here hopefully they go out well let's hop into it and let's see if we can get max points every single time Okay, so here we go into our first game, and we're going to be facing a Jesse, a Poco, and a Spike. So the good news is I've never heard of these guys before, so it won't be too, too hard, I hope. But maybe they could be low-key OP. So we're just going to be chilling over here. Going to make our move up. We're going to be able to get that Spike. Again, we have to win 10 nothing basically. That is the goal. So we're going to be going super aggro over here. We're going to be able to take down this Jesse. So we've been doing an amazing job second, and OG have been basically staying back. But that's fine, my job is to be the aggro one anyways. So just going to be chilling in the mid right here. We're going to pop our super and Oh, we're not going to get that Poco, but we're going to get it to go down anyways. Second is hiding in the bush over there, and it looks like we're going to have a fairly easy time. I don't think these guys are going to cause us much issues. I'm going to pop our super. Go after this Jesse, get the kill. Go after that Poco, also get the kill. And then this spike is going to go down. So it's currently 7-0. It's looking really good. we got the 8th gem right up here. Gonna pop our super, gonna be able to get these guys. Gonna go for the spike as well. I'm going to back up. Currently 10 to nothing, we only need one more gem. Okay, the gem's actually up there, so it's a little bit interesting. We should be able to get that kill though. And that should be 10 nothing. Let's get it, okay, perfect. 
So the spike almost got OG, but OG is able to run away. As long as we don't die here during countdown, we will be able to get the maximum amount of points, which is exactly what we want, obviously. Doing a great job over here. We're going to get a couple kills, and that is going to end the first game. So we're going to get a maximum points of 33, which is exactly what we wanted. Really excellent start over there. We're able to get star player. What? Only 30. Okay, uh, uh, that scared me. So we got 33 because we got the epic win. So we're going to exit. Let's hop into the second game and hopefully we get the exact same results. Okay, so here we go into the next game. And I've actually heard of these guys before and they have a pretty interesting comp. So this one should be a little bit interesting. Going to go into it and try and have basically the exact same results as last time. Tick versus Barley. Tick should have the advantage, but it's going to be a little bit hard for me as a Rosa to get some kills here since they all, they don't counter me, but they all have range on me. So it's going to be a little bit of a tough matchup. I'm going to go down there. There's nowhere for me to go. Caught in between the train and the... Uh, and the Piper. There's just nowhere for me to go. And they already have a few gems, so we're going to have to really clean this up or maybe try and get both of their gems for the epic win. So we're going to move up over here. It looks like the Crow has the gems. So we're going to have to try and kill that Crow and then run away. Or maybe the Crow will jump onto us. We don't know. But we definitely want to get those. Okay, perfect. The Crow's going to jump on us. I'm going to go over here and just collect those gems. So that's really, really good for us. Unfortunately, second's going to go down, but so is their Barley. We're just going to be chilling right over here. Going to get this Piper. As well. Oh, almost got the Crow, but the Crow uses Jump to run away, so that's fine. Hopefully the gem spawns on our side. Oh, spawned on theirs, but that should be fine. Just going to wait for the next one, I think. Going to go up and pressure this Crow. I'm not going to be able to get the kill, but we do have Countdown. So again, as long as we don't get reset here, we should be fine. I'm going to be able to get this Barley over here. That's going to be a kill, and that should be good enough for us. Just going to pick this up so that second can die. Going to pop my super. No way that I can die over here. Get two kills, and that is going to end the game. And again, we are able to get just enough time. Where We're going to get it at 66 points. We need one more game now to get the max for power play. Let's hop into the next game, and hopefully we can go three for three. Okay, so here we go into the next game. We're going to be going up against Big Shaq. OP meme from back in the day. Second best is going to be AFK Ock. Okay, he's going to move up. So we're going to be going up against a Jesse, a Mortis, and a Shelly. So the Shelly obviously is going to give us troubles, but it shouldn't be too, too bad. This Mortis is going to be annoying as a gem carry because maybe he can get like a couple gems and just run away with it and be a huge nuisance to us getting the epic win. Just going to back up over here. So far, it looks pretty good. <clears throat> we almost have our super, so we're going to walk up over here, activate our super, and try and get this Mortis. Not able to get the kill, but we're keeping them back really, really well. If he has one gem, that's not a huge, huge concern. We're just chilling and camping basically up here. Going to be able to secure that kill. Going to pop our super to be able to take out Big Shaq, the Shelly. And we're going to back up, so the Mortis is going to go for the kill, second best is going to be able to get it, and now we only need two more gems. So Shelly has her super, so it's obviously very concerning for me. i got to chill back here and regen. OG only needs one more, uh, one more gem in order to take the 10th. Um, we're going to back up, OG should be able to get that and just run away. So looking pretty good, again, if we, don't, if we can secure this countdown, we're going to get maximum amount of points. Just going to chill over here, going to move up and use my super, going to be able to get that Shelly. We're going to be also able to get this Mortis eventually, maybe not, maybe he will prevail and live. No, he will go down and that is going to end it. So there we go, we got the maximum amount, I think, that's back to back to back star players for us. There we go, 99 points and we are back into that number one position. There's no way that guy gets 120 points. Either going to change it or give him only two games today. So I don't know if that's going to put us on the leaderboard. They, they put us at 163rd, I guess. It doesn't really matter. Everyone is tied for first. But yeah, that's super, super cool. And that is going to end the video today. So if you guys want to see me do power play a lot, definitely let me know. I would love to include that in my videos. Maybe I can even do two videos a day where I have like a power play, like little mini series. And then I have my other video. If you guys would like that, let me know. But anyways, that is going to be it for today. I'm super happy I'm back on the content grind. You know, I took three days off, which was really nice. But I also really miss making videos for you guys and really miss just connecting with everyone via YouTube and Twitch. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. That's going to be it for today. I will catch you guys later and definitely keep you guys updated on power play. We'll see you guys later. Peace.